Hello everyone, first of all, I want to say thank you guys so much for the support that I've been getting in this channel and it has been amazing and I want to say thank you guys so much for the recent subscribers. Thank you guys, it means a lot. So as you all know from the title, we will be discussing Genshin Impact, uh, which one is better, playing with the controller or the keyboard. Now, both of this has an upside and a downside, so here's the pros and the cons of each individual I don't know what you call it, like settings, controls. So first of all, I want to discuss about the controller, the pros and the cons. Now here's the pros of the controller. There's no doubt that the controller is more comfortable to play with, okay? You can sit on a couch and just, you know, grab your controller and just play it. It is more relaxing. Using a controller, the movement is so much better because you can circle around, you can just push forward your uh, left trigger button and then the movement is so smooth, okay? And pressing button on the controller is so much better. It causes less fatigue, it is more relaxing, you can sit on a couch. It's just overall a better experience by using a controller. Not a better experience, but a more relaxing experience with a controller. And camera angle is easier to control. So while you are using your controller and adjusting your camera angle with the right trigger button, it is just smooth it is smooth now for the cons uh, by using a controller is that switching characters is not fluid um, with the movement because while you are using a controller switching characters uses your d-pad and when you are moving you cannot use the d-pad i mean you cannot quickly change the d-pad and your movement if you are relaxing on your couch okay there's no way you have to stop first you have to lift your thumb from the left trigger button, go and press the D-pad and there's no way you are not stopping while you are playing this game, okay? So secondly, I think this is like a nitpick from me because there's a difference between the X button and the circle button in the PS4 and in PS, I mean PC. So if you play on the PS4, you press X button, you confirm. But if you guys play on PC, you press X, it is cancel. Like, why the hell would you do that? And you cannot change it, man. You cannot change it, which is quite a bummer. Because I have a muscle memory that pressing X equals to confirm. Yeah, it's not good. It's not a good experience at all. And it is a bit harder to aim while you are using a controller, of course. Shortcut is a bit of a chore to press. Because you cannot press only one button, like on your keyboard, you press C and you open the character's menu tab. On your controller, you have to press like L1 plus right trigger. You have to press this, press that, plus this, press this, plus press this, and then you go to a menu. It's not a good thing if you call it like shortcut, okay? Because it is very inconvenient. But that is the downside of the controller, that is. But it is still fine if you are playing relaxing, you know, on your couch, sitting back. And just play this game so for my conclusion if you guys are you know relaxing if you guys just want to relax playing this game well use a controller okay you can sit back relax on the couch uh, or you know just lying down on your bed then i think controller is a very good choice to play with okay so now let's go into the keyboard first of all i want to say the pros first so every shortcut is easier Okay, you press one button, you go it into that menu tab. That's it. No bullshit, no pressing this, pressing that. Just press one button. You want to summon gacha? Press F3. You want to go to the character's tab? Press C. You want to go to back? Press B. That's it. It is that simple. You want to open map? You press M. That's it. You open it. Secondly, aiming is a lot easier while you are using mouse and keyboard. Of course, it is very crucial aiming precisely while you are using an archer class. You need to hit that weakness from your enemy so you can get that big damage and making life a little bit easier. And combat switching between characters is a bit easier than playing on a controller. So that's a good thing. And I think for me, in my opinion, mouse and keyboard is a very good controller or, you know, a very good settings for a good hardcore player. So now let's move to the cons. Movement, like while you are using WASD, is a bit clunky, like it's a bit stiff, if you know what I mean. Uh, keyboard can cause fatigue. If you play too long, if you press like W forward, holding shift, 
holding uh, your right mouse button to basically just run it can cause fatigue because I personally experienced that myself I was playing for about like three hours I press W holding just oh come on man let's go like I haven't unlocked everything okay I haven't unlocked the waypoint so I have to run and it causes fatigue in my fingers so if you guys are sensitive uh, in your hands your hands uh, can get tired quick so I think using a controller is the way to go and you basically cannot relax on a keyboard well you can but you know you press a lot more button than on your uh, controller <laughs> yeah there's no way you can relax so for my conclusion I think for a good PC player I think mouse and keyboard is the way to go overall it is more reliable the shortcut is a lot more easier, you can aim easier with your mouse and you hit your uh, enemy's weakness. So I think for a good hardcore player, I think this mouse and keyboard is the way to go. Even if you guys are not hardcore and you don't have a controller, keyboard, mouse and keyboard, it is still fine. You don't need a controller. But if you want to relax, sit back on your couch, go for the controller, just go buy one, man. Personally, for me, I like to switch between controller and keyboards because I do play in my PS4 and my PC. So I switch back um, according to what I'm in the mood for because I don't like playing with my controller on my PC because the Genshin Impact itself switch the buttons. Okay? Like I said in the beginning of the video, the X button and the circle button has been switched. Like the confirmation has been switched. The X button for the PC, it is canceling, okay? There's no way I can <laughs> I can switch my muscle memory to press X for cancel. So that is pretty annoying. There's no way to change it right now. But I hope they patch it and give the options to do so. Again, thank you guys so much. Uh, this is the end of the video. Thank you guys so much for the support, guys. The recent subscriber. It has been amazing. And yeah, I do hope you enjoyed this video. And I hope my opinion also doesn't matter like most of you guys. Alright, thank you guys so much for watching this video. And I'll see you guys again on the next one, guys. Bye, guys.